Did you know that testosterone is not just important for men, but for women too? It occurs in both sexes from birth, and it plays a vital role in various aspects for our health and well-being. For men, testosterone is often associated with their libido and sexual performance. Testosterone is responsible for stimulating the beginning of sexual development in boys, and it helps maintain a man's health throughout his entire life. This means it is crucial for things like muscle mass, bone density, and overall energy levels. On the other hand, women have much lower levels of testosterone than men. However, it still plays an important role in their sex drive, energy, and physical strength. No matter your gender, testosterone is something you don't want to overlook. Now here's the thing. As we age, it's natural for our testosterone levels to decrease. The good news is that there are steps we can take to slow down the testosterone reduction and even reverse this process. If you're starting to notice a dip in your energy levels or sex drive, it might be worth considering ways to boost your testosterone levels naturally. Did you know that a man's testosterone level peaks in early adulthood? However, even after that, it continues to play a vital role in various aspects of our health. For starters, testosterone helps maintain bone and muscle mass. It also affects how our body stores fat and helps with the production of red blood cells. Plus, it's important for our sexual and physical health, including things like sex drive and performance. However, if a man's testosterone levels drastically decrease, it can lead to several unpleasant symptoms. For example, difficulty achieving or maintaining an erection is a common issue. Increased body fat and decreased muscle strength can also be a problem, as can hair loss and swelling of the breasts. Moreover, it can also cause deep sleep disturbances, fatigue, and even depression, all of which have been linked to low testosterone levels. If you're experiencing any of these symptoms and suspect that low testosterone might be the issue, it's worth talking to your doctor. There are treatments available that can help boost your testosterone levels and improve your overall health and well-being. Let's discuss six things that can help improve your testosterone levels. Number one, getting enough sleep. Getting enough sleep is super important for maintaining healthy testosterone levels. When we don't get enough sleep, our bodies can't produce the hormones and chemicals we need to function properly, including testosterone. Research has shown that even just one week of restricted sleep can cause testosterone levels to drop by up to 15%, which is why it is so important to make sleep a priority if you want to maintain healthy testosterone levels. Understanding testosterone, I think, is, is vital for men and women because it's so powerful. Obviously, get your sleep right. That's an important one, and you do that through, so that's an indirect effect. So how much sleep should you aim for? Well, experts recommend getting at least seven to eight hours of sleep each night. Of course, everyone's individual sleep needs may vary, so it's important to listen to your body and get the right amount of sleep that feels right for you. Number two, maintain a balanced diet. Eating a balanced and nutritious diet is the key to maintaining healthy hormone levels and overall health. When it comes to diet, the best approach is to focus on unprocessed foods that offer a good balance of fats, carbohydrates, and proteins. Aim to include plenty of fresh fruits and vegetables, lean proteins like chicken and fish, and healthy fats like avocados and nuts. It not only helps to maintain healthy testosterone levels, but it also promotes overall long-term health. Number three, stay active. Another great way to boost your testosterone levels is by staying active. Studies have found that the more physically active you are, the higher your testosterone levels tend to be. Increasing your physical activity may actually be more beneficial for improving testosterone levels than weight loss alone. Whether you enjoy hitting the gym, going for a run, or simply taking a brisk walk, staying active is a great way to maintain healthy hormone levels. Number four, vitamins and supplements. Have you ever considered taking vitamins or supplements to boost your testosterone levels? Well, it turns out that certain vitamins, supplements, and herbs can help correct deficiencies and increase testosterone levels in the body. However, before you start taking any supplements, it is important to talk to your health practitioner. They can recommend the most beneficial ones for you and ensure that you're taking the correct dosage. This has also led Dr. Huberman to list two supplements he has tested and proven to boost testosterone levels. Mostly. In the supplementation space, there are two things that have worked very well for me and that I've recommended to a number of people that 
have worked well for them. And those two things are Tongat Ali, which at 400 milligrams per day is thought to reduce sex hormone binding globulin because for those that don't know, testosterone can exist in a free or bound form. People hear binding globulins and they bind up testosterone and prevent free testosterone. They think this is terrible, but actually albumin and sex hormone binding globulin are wonderful because they ensure that whatever testosterone you make will be delivered to your tissues over a long period of time. And different tissues need different amounts of testosterone. And so you don't want to plummet sex hormone binding globulin, but Tonga Ali, either through reducing sex hormone binding globulin or through direct effects on increasing androgen release will increase your testosterone. Now, the the way to explore this, and I'm not saying anyone should do this, you definitely want to work with your physician, but the way to explore this is 400 milligrams per day taken once per day early in the day because it can have a little bit of a stimulant effect, make you more alert. That works well. It does need to be taken chronically. It tends to work better as you get into the second and third month of use. And I don't see any reason to cycle it unless somehow something you know, spikes on your liver enzymes or something. He also went further to talk about another supplement, Fidogia agrestis. The other supplement that is quite useful is Fidogia agrestis. Fidogia agrestis is one of these plant alkaloids that I think it comes from a Nigerian shrub. I might have that wrong, but Fidogia agrestis acts as a luteinizing hormone mimic. So it actually stimulates the testes to produce more testosterone. So it's like HCG. It's like a... It's it's a a, bit like HCG, but for whatever reason, it doesn't seem to increase estrogen, which is unique because HCG will increase estrogen. Number five. Review medications. Another thing to consider is the medications you're taking. Prescription medications can help manage health conditions, but they can also be a common cause of low testosterone levels. Dr. Huberman highlighted that some people even abuse supplements. And some people make the mistake of taking far too much Fidogia agrestis. I think on the bottle, they recommend three, two to three times a day. One 425 milligram capsule, I I believe is more than sufficient. If you suspect that your medication is affecting your hormone levels, be sure to talk to your doctor about it. Number six, avoid drugs and alcohol. At last, it's important to be mindful of drug and alcohol use if you want to maintain healthy testosterone levels. According to research, drug and alcohol abuse can negatively impact the glands and hormones involved in male reproductive health, leading to lower testosterone levels. So, if you're looking to boost your testosterone levels, it's best to avoid excessive drug and alcohol use. What are your thoughts on all of this? Let us know in the comments section. If you found this video interesting or helpful, don't forget to like it, press subscribe, and the notification bell so you won't miss any of our future uploads. Until then, take care.